Aquarians, this is the week of the chariot. It's a fire week. Fire week. Movement. Movement. Fire week. Fire week, my darlings. A lot of movement. A lot of movement. Fire week, baby girls and boys. Baby girl and boys. Baby girl and boys. There is a fire week. I'm using this new deck. It's a Russian deck. Um, I will do a. I wish if you guys could see the the cards. Uh, I'm gonna be trying out. Oopsie Daisy, something came out for you, Aquarians. All right, so I see new love is coming in. All right, some of you who were hoping for love, new love is definitely going to be coming in. Whatever is happening and transpiring, a message came out. So someone who was thinking about love a while ago and wonder if love is coming in. Yes, it's going to be coming in. Could be coming in in this week. But whatever is transpiring, I see love is going to be here for you in this week. Okay. So, all right. So that was um, some positive messages for you guys. And... Um, I'm going to see what your energy is, is that is coming out. So this week is from the 6th until the 12th, Aquarians. All right. So let's see. Um, we see the energy of you, um, people between the, um, the um, ages of 18 and 45. And I see events that occur with great uh, speed. Take time to clearly review your options creative solutions okay so whatever is transpiring in this week just take the time to make the decision before you make any decision take the time think about it before you make the decision all right it's about intelligence decisiveness um ideologies and it's um um, um threatless okay so threatless in this week all right, so um, let's go and see what's coming up for you, Aquarians. Um, this is going to be um, good. Um, in this week, we're going to be looking at, I've changed up the format in this week um, in order to make some, I like changing. I like changes. I don't know about you guys, but I like the changes, okay? So, all right, so okay so we see um the scent of the week we have with love love is coming up and it's a week of reunion um so a lot of you might want to re reunite i see new love is coming in okay and i see a reunion that is coming up in this week so it is what is going on <laughs> it is a, a, a really positive alignment of energy I have this new deck um, my only thing is that it's like a paper deck so it, it doesn't shuffle that good but you will see it so, all right so um, let's go in so what we see here that is happening and transpiring I see a whole lot of deliriousness um, with you Aquarian and this deliriousness is that um, some communication and this what this is why um, whatever the information the communication that is coming up I see it is going to be creating a lot of deliriousness around you Aquarian so Monday um, you could be after communicating or you're going to be receiving some information that is a, a, a little bit off um, for some of you so you have to be aware of um, this issue and this situation because whatever the information is is going to be a little bit off for some of you some of you are dealing with a new love or a child whoever this person is as a fire sign person whoever this child is is um definitely um a fire sign person it could be a new love but it could be a, a child but there need to be some clear communication between you and this person whatever is happening or transpiring there need to be positive clear communication between you and this person um then we have on wednesday the energy of love is coming in and i see a whole lot of money could be coming in so um your ex-partner could be paying alimentation some unexpected money is going to be coming in i don't know i can't see it properly so be aware of this what is happening but a whole lot of money is going to be coming in um whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring i see um, um a child or someone who is a fire sign 
could be um, offering you a whole lot of money maybe it's a payout um, maybe it's a situation where it's a payout where um, some form of payout is going to be coming in for some of you I see um, there was a whole lot of lies and deceptiveness with a Gemini and some money or um, some some of you you're going to be finding out something about your fortune where there was some deceptive play with your fortune so you have to be aware um, because I see they're going to be finding out that uh, um, some money was stolen on Thursday and whatever is transpiring whoever has stole this money and a whole lot of money and I see they're going to be bringing an end that um, whoever has stolen this money you're going to be finding out and they're going to be bringing an end to this so you're dealing with a fire sign man whoever this man is this is an, a fire sign man so some of your could be in a relationship with a fire sign man whoever this fire sign man is i see that this person is in love with you but it could be a father figure that is going to be helping you out financially but it's coming in as a lover whoever this person is is definitely um 45 years and older and it is coming up as a new love that is going to be coming in your life now do not trust this man because he is false false sita is here false sita is here ladies and gentlemen so whatever is happening and transpired i see false sita um this person is not really honest um this person is a fire side man whoever this fire side man is it's coming in as a lover it could be your partner you could be having a relationship with this person but this person is very false you got to be aware of this um this person pretend as if they care for you but it's only um for materialistic wealth so you got to be aware of this person then i see some um sadness um and some regrets so some of you could have gotten involved with a fire sign man and whoever this person is hasn't been very honest and i see some sadness and regret because truth is coming out about this person this person is coming up as you you were in a relationship with this person or you're married to this person okay so it's coming up as a relationship a marriage a business partner whoever this situation is i see you have huge regrets and Something is going to be transpiring that you are going to be finding out that this man has stake you for a lot. Whoever this man is, is very deceptive, a very deceptive person. And it's coming up as if you were in a relationship or a business partner, business contract with this man. And I see the deceptiveness of this man that is happening and transpiring. But I see this man is coming in offering you love, but it is as false as what be aware and be careful of who this man is. Because whatever he's bringing to the table is very deceptive and very false. So you got to be on top of your game. Um, I see love is coming in, but this love is very false, ladies and gentlemen. It has the energy of a falsita. And this is coming up um, in the weekend, so some of you could be meeting someone. And is going to be going out with this person in the weekend this person is a very very false person um, whoever this person is and whatever they are bringing to the table do not trust this person ladies and gentlemen I'm telling you this it's not healthy it's not going to be a healthy relationship or healthy situation um then i see um this is the page of pentacles so some of you are dealing with a young person and i see you need to communicate um clearly with this person whoever this person is is a very young person this person could be a child a taurus virgo or a capricorn person i see communication needs to this person needs to communicate with you whatever is transpiring some of you could block this person don't want to have anything to do with this person but i see you gotta communicate with this person because there is some information that this person um can um give to you whatever is transpiring i see um this person can have information in order to give to you so open up to this situation a lot of worries is here for a fire sign person whoever this fire sign person is um you could have been in a relationship with this fire sign person but this fire sign person has lied 
use information of your child in order to acquire access and i see that they found out uh, what this fire sign person have done and the lies and deceptiveness of a fire sign person it could be your child's mother or father but you're going to be finding out a whole lot over this fire sign person now the seven of cups is here when it comes on to the lover and the money so um i see some of you could have been dealing with a scorpion either a scorpion or a virgo whoever this lover is if you're in a relationship with a scorpion and a virgo i see you could have been um dealing with a scorpion and a virgo um but whatever is happening and transpiring i see multiple because the energy of seven is about a whole lot of um it's, it's as if you are having are creating a whole lot of uh, um ways or opportunity to create a lot of wealth and this is good and whatever you're doing people are going to be loving it and it doesn't really matter what you do people are going to be loving it so now i see they're finding out that a leo has lied and stolen a lot of money whatever has transpired there whoever is this leo a family member or a friend or someone at work but is it's your fortune okay it's your fortune and the leo have lied and stolen a lot of your fortune and they caught this leo with what they have done and what has transpired so monday to um thursday especially thursday they're going you're going to be finding out that a leo has either used your information or um create some sort of a deceptiveness in order to acquire a whole lot of money so is it your child is it uh, um your partner whoever this person is uh, um it they are showing up and they are showing up and whatever is transpiring um you are going to be saddened by this situation okay and it is an older woman so you older ladies this week is going to affect especially monday to friday this week is going to affect you older ladies especially monday to friday because it has something to do with your child as a leo who has access um your um assets who have access your assets or use your information in order to acquire money and it's definitely a child it's happening to a child and i see you old lady are so saddened but yet still you're saddened but you want to heal the situation with this um child and this person so this is why information is going to be coming out and you old lady is going to be finding out what a, a, leo, a, a child that is a leo or an aries leo or sagittarius have done i see a whole lot of delusions because uh, a young person maybe the sister is our brother that is a taurus virgo or capricorn is going to be telling you so i see a young virgo is going to be um a young virgo or um i yeah a young virgo is going to be coming in and um this could be your uh sister your daughter or your son is going to be coming in and letting you know what has happened now friday is the day where strength Fri friday is the day where strength okay and for some of you it can be friday but um majority of you it could happen in a different way strength whatever the situation and the issue is i see strength is coming up where some of you are trying to deal with a situation with a leo man a really deceptive leo man and you're going to be seen um, through the vase of this leo man and seeing how deceptive this leo man is and what this leo man has done he and his lover he and his partner they are finding out what he and his partner has done because this older man is um in love with a younger leo because they're definitely leo they're coming up with the energy vibration of the leos and um this older man together with a younger woman they're going to be finding out the lies and deceptiveness and what they have created and how they have created some real deceptiveness that um has affected you guys whether it's your your in-laws or your family or your sister whoever these people are they have done some injustice now i see some of you and the major arcana is really coming up to help you guys in this week i see some of you what is going to be happening and transpiring is that 
you are going to be overcoming some um, false play, something that make you feel um, very, something that makes you feel um, that you had some regrets over. You're going to be getting over the regrets, regrets with a cancer, and you're going to be walking away from this cancer. You're going to go for a new start, whether this cancer was a lover, whether this cancer was a friend, whoever this cancer is and whatever that was transpiring, whatever the regrets is or was and whatever that was transpiring, you're going to be letting this go and walking away. I see some of you could be reunited also with a cancer and it's going to be a lot of happy moments where a reunion between you and a cancer is going to be coming back and there is going to be a lot of happy moments. Falsita is uh, um, whatever the situation is, uh, Fall seater, this is coming up as um, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman that is going to be entering your life. Um, it could be you could have been false to this person. Is it your mom? But it's as if this person is reaching out to you and trying to heal a situation between you and her. Is this your mom? Who is this person? But this person has been offering you love and it's as if you're not accessing accepting it but this person could also be false okay because this is the energy of false sita so you gotta be aware of what is happening and transpiring um it could be that some of you are offering a woman love but it's not coming from your heart it's, it's really not coming from your heart and whatever is transpiring i think that you guys should be reconsidering um how you are expressing um, yourself to another person definitely i see um reunion is here definitely reunion is here in this week for you guys it's all about re reuniting with a lover okay so this week is all about reuniting with a lover so this is going to be really wonderful really positive it is the energy of reunion reuniting with a lover some of you could also be getting married so ladies and gentlemen i want to say thank you so much for being here namaste until next time